Now, what song are you going to be adding a saxophone solo to? It's Because of You by Kelly Clarkson. It's a great song. But the way it is, I'm not sure it needs a saxophone solo. Uh, but That's you're, what you're, we're going to see. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to find out. Whatever you're ready, go for it. <laughs> oh, that is Kirsten Belt at Jimmy Fallon. He's a 20-year-old saxophone player from the Netherlands. He's known for his popular videos on YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram. He adds sax solos to songs that they say don't really need them, and the results are awesome because we remember every song I, every in the 80s had a yeah, sax solo, did. I think. Karsten, how are you? Hi, I'm good. Yeah, how are you? I'm good. So, hey, I'm just curious how this all started because, I mean, there's plenty of kids out there who play sax or clarinet in the, in the local band. How did it become this thing where you were so good at it that you're playing on the street and now you have a TikTok account? Yeah, that's actually how I started. I started playing on the streets, um, so uh, then I play pop songs, and it's really fun because everyone around you, you instantly see if they like what you're playing or not. Um, and uh, for me, it, it was getting a little bit boring to play those pop songs over and over and over again. So I started to adding, started adding little solo parts, little improvisation, and just started jamming with the songs I was playing. Um, and then during uh, COVID, I thought. Let's just um, start posting just these solos on TikTok. I didn't really know TikTok, but I thought, let's just try that. Uh, and it really popped off. Uh, the, the second video I did of that concept of adding saxophone solos to songs that don't need them, um, it, it got over 2 million views, wow. which was absolutely incredible. I, I didn't <laughs> yeah. even understand TikTok, and suddenly that was happening. Your following, so, yeah. it's, it's unbelievable, this following that you have. Uh, we want to play another example here. Uh, this one, a song from Olivia Rodrigo. Let's listen. <laughs> Garrison, it's brilliant. I, I know you're not old enough to know the 80s, but it, truly every song oh. had, a, had a sax solo. Oh. So did you get that idea from your parents? <laughs> No, no, really, actually, uh, but I really love 80s music, so okay. uh, obviously, uh, because of the saxophone. So I started searching for songs with saxophone, and then you come to the 80s very quickly. Oh, yeah. Have you uh, heard? So, yeah. I know, I know you performed your Kelly Clarkson song on her show for her. Did she like it? And have you done that for anyone else? Um, she really uh, liked it. I, I performed another song at her show, actually, I, because I recorded my video after that. Oh, okay. Uh, but, but, she, but she really liked that one, at least. Uh, and um, one really cool experience uh, with the original artist was uh, with Dean Lewis, because I recorded a, a solo to his song Be All Right. Um, and he loved it so much that he asked me to play it live with him in Amsterdam when he was performing there. Oh my so gosh. So suddenly I was standing next to someone I'm a huge fan of, like he's a big idol for me. I was just standing next to him on stage because of some TikTok video I made. <laughs> it's really incredible. All right, I think we have another example here. The song uh, Take Me to Church, it's a real popular All song right. here. Uh, let's hear what you did with that one. Amen. Amen. solo from is it Baker Street Baker Street yeah yeah oh, <laughs> it's brilliant I you know what I don't see a lot of kids playing the saxophone anymore no. or am I just not moving in the right circles Karsten I think it's coming back a little bit um, usually people who play saxophone go into classical or jazz and I think it's coming back into the pop music right, right. now so I think you're, you're gonna see much more of it soon I hope so at least have, have any artists uh, reached out to you directly and say hey I want you to add a sax solo to my song no, not, not yet, actually. No, no. It was mostly <laughs> I made the solo and right. the artist responded. But yeah. Anytime One day now. It might happen. Um, <laughs> yeah, you, now, so. so, what do you do? Are you, are you in school full time? Are you working full time? Or is this your full time gig? 
I'm uh, actually studying software engineering right now, so I'm, I'm trying to combine doing that and music at the same time. So uh, it's a lot, but it's really nice. I like both things, uh, but obviously music is my passion. Good. Uh, but I, yeah, my study is really nice as well. Do you have a band or can people see you perform live anywhere else? I'm working on that right now huh? to actually get my own uh, show, but currently I'm mostly performing with other artists that I um, meet through social media, um, and I hope to do that more often soon. Well, well, we have no doubt that you'll be a great uh, software engineer, but we hope that you continue with this music and uh, join us again in the near future. I hope so too, yeah. Thanks, right. Karsten. There's where you can follow him on all the social media. Thanks for being with us. There's his uh, website there, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. We'll be right back. Thank you so much.